Turning now to the housing market, U.S. home prices started the summer at a record high, but the pace of price increases moderated in June. For more on the numbers, let's bring in Yahoo Finance's Danny Romero from the newsroom. Hey, Danny. Brad, home buyers can't catch a break. Home prices hit a new all-time high in June, but home price growth is slowing. The S&P Case-Shiller National Home Price Index rose 0.2% in June on a monthly basis and marked the fifth consecutive monthly gains. Now, on an annual basis, the national measure rose 5.4%, but that's lower than the 5.9% increase we saw in May. Remember, this is a lagging Indicator. June's Case-Shiller Index tracked a three-month average that started in April when mortgage rates were hovering around that 7%. Separately, the index that tracks home prices in 20 of the largest cities gained 0.4% on a monthly basis. New York continues to be an expensive city among the 20 largest metros in the U.S. Annual home price gains reached 9% there. San Diego, Las Vegas followed with gains of over 8%. Now, this could be due to the supply and demand dynamics in those areas. Still, affordability remains a challenge here. Mortgage rates are now moving lower, helping with affordability, but buyers and sellers are in this wait and see mode. Redfin reported this morning that over 85% of homeowners nationwide have a mortgage below 6%. This could mean that a majority of sellers and buyers are waiting for mortgage rates to drop even further as the Federal Reserve has signaled a rate cut next month. Now, bottom line, housing strategists at Morgan Stanley believe that 